cloud network in this tutorial i am going to show you how to install your nigeus lock server on your uh, red hat linux or centos uh, 7 uh, you can install this one also in fedora 2019 21 also you can install you can also install in desktop and uh, server also the same method and same procedure need to follow that I'm going to show you every step every command you can find below to my video in the description box so I'm using CentOS 7 in that in, I'm going to show you how to install Nigeria's lock server the steps is very simply we have one two five steps are there for these installations and the first one is to I'm going inside the for temp directory and that one I'm going to download these nagers the size will be around 1116 MB will be the size for this download after that I'm going to extract then I'm going to uh, go to the inside the folder of extracting this is the CD and then I'm going to start the installation after that I'm going to finally be uh, type the IP address of this uh, server or you uh, domain name you can type then you need to give slash like server so to access this uh, Nigeria's log server. So let us begin now. Go to that installation. I'm going to. Uh, I want to show you this Nigeria's uh, download WSG log server. So you can find this is for your VS Code, <laughs> Unix install, virtual machine, and this is for source installation. You can find the size is showing 118 MB. This is for going to be download. Here you can see the installation for this log server. You can find. So this is the link you can find in my video. Just need to copy and paste it here. You can find everything here. CentOS Linux 7 core, 7 core version 64 bit supported. You can also install 32 bit also. And I'm going to log in with the root directly. You can also log in with the normal user also. First of all, I'm checking the IP address. So such that means you need to type. So now the command is IP ABD. Now you can see. Um, let me check here. Here is my IP address. ENSPO03 192.168.0.30 is my IP address. And now I'm going to cd slash temp. And here we are going to download the images here. So my, uh, my friend, uh, you need to type it here. And this is a link you need to type. You can find this link in my video description uh, in my video to my video in the description box just press enter and it's going to be start downloading so it's showing this 118 mb size which is going to be downloads so now you can see on screen completed now now we are going to check the download actually play this one type ls to check so here you can see on the red color Nigeria's log server latest one has been downloaded. I am going to extract this one. Type LDF. You need to give Nigeria's file name. Yes. So you need to give here the XZF and give the Nigeria's file. Press enter. And now you will see. So you can see on this blue color one folder has been created after the extract. I am going to inside this folder of and you press enter clear this one again ls so you can see dot slash you need to run full install press enter now it's going to be run the installation so you can see now the startup local has completed ok and the play testing is running now checking the packages also this was the packages which i have already been installed here if the sum of the packages is missing, uh, there's going to be also if this download hung here. You can see this download install is showing the download is 46 MB is going to download install size will be 169 MB is going to be download. So now you should just keep waiting here for this download now. It's running my screen. So it's showing that Nigeria's lock server installation success and you can finish the final setup set step by step for this uh, set up steps for this Nigeria's lock server by visiting this http uh, you need to give the ip address of the server and you need to give slash Nigeria's lock server once again i'm going to think the, take the ip address here yes, okay. now here i got a 
that's my IP address and I'm going to open browser with this slash log my server so let us check now here I'm going to type in the IP address here in place of IP address we can use your uh, domain name also this slash and press in my js server lock so after typing press enter and now you see this finished the installation and installation set so showing about this three installation select installation or add instance to be showing the free trial if you have key you can enter here key also and then you can give this address and giving the password for this confirm the same password here my email id which i am giving to plotnet that's my ip address and once you confirm different emails you can select your language also by selecting Take the find who is the solution you can give the new password also. So once you save all these things, it will be redirect to your NetJS log server. Now you can see you need to log in into the NetJS with this username and the password. You can check the box click in login and you can also check if you forget the passwords, you can say this forgetting the password is see there setting if you forget the password means once you click on login. It will be redirect to login. So the one login page is showing the remote password. This file is going to expire in 60 days. So this log server will expire in 60 days. That's for two months only. And if you want to have a full lifetime, you need to purchase the license key showing. At least you can enter the license key. So once you came into this, you are about this Chrome. Showing alerting and this one is a Windows 9. You can see a package for the error for SSS login, Windows 10, my dashboard is there. You can see the log sources and application. You can see the name, password is setting this. Also, you can see admin is showing logout is there. First, you click on you will find other things also. So, this is Run the latest version of this okay. This also I will check. Once you get, you can go for this here. Um, log out also. Once you log out this one. So for any question, please comment below to my video and like us my video and share my video among your friends and relatives. Help to spread my channel. Uh, please subscribe to Cloudnet channel. Thank you for watching my video.